I hadn't been able to go. And so of course I got a crick in my neck. And its name is Rick. It gives you such a crick in the neck. That's what that always makes me think of. Tim Allen. Yeah, no. <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions, idiots. I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram, Nobody Twitter, or Tree Scott. Nobody's ever. 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 I don't think to be with that. Today we're doing some stand-up comedy. Good job, Rick. Good job. Uh, it's, uh... Uh... Say all this. Biswa, Kali and Roth, extroverts and chaos. Extroverts and chaos. Hmm. You're an extrovert. Depends on the situation. Most of the time, yes. Most of the time. If I am in... You're far more extroverted than you are introverted. Absolutely. But for example, if I'm invited over to somebody's place mm -hmm. and there's 20 people there and I know the person who invited me, I'll be, I'll be very introverted mm. because I don't want to be misconstrued. I don't feel like I'm, I need to, I feel like I need to be invited into the circle before I can be fully myself. Otherwise I'm trying to get attention. I am. So in those circumstances, I'm an, I'm an introvert. I am. But otherwise I'm fake. I'm different because Somebody like my wife would be is would be defined as an introvert, and she is 100%. Um, people would often perceive me as an extrovert because I'm comfortable in social situations. Like it doesn't right. give me anxiety to be in a right. group of people at all. At all. Uh, it does my wife. <laughs> no, but um, you don't seek. You don't prefer to be with people. You prefer to be yeah uh, on your own. Usually by myself. Yeah, yeah. I'm I, I'm I'm discreetly. Yeah, where, whereas I like to be, yeah. like, in a situation, most of the time, I have to be in a certain mood to, like, for example, if you were going to the Hawaiian Islands, mm -hmm. you'd be more likely to go to Kauai than Maui. I've, under, I, I've never been to either island, but I've heard that Kauai is the more private, secluded place, and Maui is the more active. Well, they're, they're both pretty secluded, if, if, if you're comparing them to the big island. Uh, but yeah, that it's Kauai's more secluded even. And that Maui. would be your preference than the place where there's a lot of people doing stuff together. I love Maui too. Yeah. But yeah. Okay. I understand what you're saying. Yeah. Um, if you're wanting to just be alone, Kauai is the place. It's the place to be. Yeah. Anyways, so this All should right. be good. I think we've, uh, I don't know if we've seen some of the pits. You guys can tell us. Maybe we'll recognize them uh, when it comes in. Or her. This video contains adult language, by the way. So I sure if, hope it does. If you're offended by the words duty and poopy caca. Don't want Probably it. should turn away. Here we go. I hope I laugh. Me too, it's comedy. <laughs> <laughs> I grew up an introverted, and I grew up an introverted view, idea uh, of enjoying something in total than others. Uh, like, if you say, bro, I'm going to go and chill, man, enjoy it. I'm going to go and show you. Extroverts cannot do that shit. They have to wake up every day like in Santa. What is the fun with people? Good coffee shops, but you know, cafe latte, chini, come, or cappuccino, chini, gada, hota, hey, 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 they don't get it. Come on, I'm going to come out, 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 come out
that's where extroverts like uniqueness of thought comes uh, the beautiful idea that they have come up with it's called festivals <laughs> festivals are chaotic destructive activities is when nothing happens apart from extroverts getting happy <laughs> keep your ears open on the day of diwali you hear the whole range of chaos in sound lakshmi bombs are like a whistling rocket that dum dum that's all right extroverts the hey must be हाँ देखते हैं ये फेस्टिवल। If an alien species is looking over India on the day of Diwali, they'll be like, Oh my God, इस कंट्री में सब स्पेस एंथुसियस्ट हैं। लेकिन इनसे रॉकेट बनता नहीं है। सौ मीटर में फट जाता है इनका रॉकेट। कुछ भी चल रहा है। हर कलर का लाइट घर पे डाल के दब 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 How do you know that doesn't mean something in alien Morse code? What if alien is looking at you? What? I'm a madam. Just tell me. How are you? Not sure. Not sure. It always gets a big laugh. It does. Diwali is still open. Holi. Holi, you have a choice. On the day of Holi, I don't want to play Holi. 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 But the success of Holi depends on how many people they're forced to participate in Holi. So they can't play it alone. वो लोग सब अपने ऊपर लगा लिया। अब आएगा bro। तुम्हारे क्यों बैठा है bro? है ना बाहर enjoy करते हैं हम लोग। अभी हम लोग एक fluorescent के साथ black मिला के नया color बनाया। उसका नाम है dark fluorescent। वो दिन में observe कर रहता है, रात को छोड़ता नहीं है। आना बाहर खेलते हैं अभी नहीं बल्कि नहीं खेलना चाहते। I am not interested. Why are you hiding, bro? Why are you? I'm not hiding every day. I am here. You are in your own house today. You are out. I am telling why you are hiding, bro. I am telling you, bro. Because you are a pussy. You are a pussy, bro. You are a big pussy. That's why you can't enjoy it. Come on, friends. Let's sing. Pussy, 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 Every fucking time, खुद सिल्वर पहन के घूम रहा है। सर से सिल्वर लगा के साथ में तो उतरता नहीं। What is the pride in being silver? मैं पूछती हूँ तो सिल्वर है। क्या सोच के सिल्वर लगा? लोगों के तो Oh my God, मुझे इंसान लगा था ये तो ज्वेलरी निकला। चल क्या रहा? You have single handedly stopped evolution by putting silver on your head. Muchly silver होता है। वो पानी से निकल के इवॉल्व किया पांच मिलियन साल इंसान बना स्किन मिला लेग मिला उसको तू वापस जा मछली के साथ है दैट्स योर लेवल ऑफ इंटेलिजेंस इफ यू डोंट बिलीव मी गो स्टार्ट स्विमिंग मछली एंड लेके आ गया मेरा दोस्त क्या कर रहे हो So stupid. This this just blows my mind about fucking extroverts. When I see a mutki, I'm like, what is it? When extroverts see a mutki, they're like, bro, this is a festival. First, this mutki is a big one. Then, they put a glass on the top. 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 So, how much can you do that? And then, और मैं जब उस पिरामिड के ऊपर खड़ा होकर मर्जी को तोड़ रहा होऊंगा, तो हर विंडो के अंदर देख के बोलूंगा। मैं सिल्वर। इस वर्ष के लोग क्रिएट शेक कुछ नहीं कर सकते। That's why when a lot of people get together and they go do chaos, it's remembered in history as an achievement. When people go, you go, you're looking at a pyramid. Oh my God, beautiful. Now this better. Pyramid उधर खड़ा है. You're like, bro. पांच हजार लोग दस साल तक केवस नहीं किया। Beautiful। बगल से बंदा है ना? लेकिन अगर उसके ऊपर एक मर्की रहते हैं, कितना केवस मच सकता है? Silver तू इधर? मैं नदी से निकल के आया अभी। मच भी लोग पीछे। Silver, silver, देखो हमारा silver क्या आ गया क्या है? Too quickly. Thank you, Hamanshu. That ended way too quick. Well, I'm sure, yeah, this was just a little clip of his full hour set, I'm sure. Yeah. Uh, but he's very funny. Very funny. And also, I'm proud of us because 
a, a year ago, we might not have known that clay pot reference. Yeah. We definitely know. We know I, the clay pot reference. Even though I forget what it's called, the festival. The festival. But, but uh, we know, we've seen multiple videos of when they come over and they have to get the clay pot of the, the curd. The curd and break it. Yep. Which I totally want to play. Looks yeah. Very, it's funny. very fun. But yeah, he's very funny. Uh, I, like I love him. his little throwaways too. <laughs> yeah, he'll say something and then they're applauding and as it dies down, he'll say, "Yeah, I don't understand the fuck." <laughs> <You're> a fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, I totally agree. I. Uh, it's funny. Is most of your family extroverted? Yes, everyone. Lexi. Oh, sure. I thought you meant like my your, side your of the parents. My I know side your parents are. My parents, my grandparents, my cousins. Well, my you're aunts, Italian. My I don't think there's. All... I don't think there's one Italian that's Italians not introverted. <laughs> New York Italians and Jews. They're the loudest, most big people. Yeah. And think anybody else who isn't as big and as loud as us. What's wrong with you? <laughs> yeah. Yep. Of of the kids, um, Ashley's. Oh, well, I know Ashley's not the true. extrovert. Uh, Alexis and Micah are selectively extroverted. Yeah. They're not uncomfortable around other people, but they're not definitively extrovert like Ashley is. Yeah. When they're with people they know, huge extroverts. Of the three, Micah's the introvert. Yeah. He can sit at home and do nothing just by himself and be absolutely contented for days on end and doesn't bother him one bit. Ashley would go nuts if she had to stay at home by herself for three days and do nothing. <laughs> that would funny drive, drive her crazy. My, Me too. My dad is an extrovert. My mother is an extrovert. My full brother, my older brother, is an extrovert. Uh, but my stepdad, my stepbrother, uh, my half brother, they're all introverted. Mm. Like they need, like they could stay at home for a week and be right and just read books totally and do content, be fine. just yeah, being no. by themselves. And so that's probably why I'm a little bit of a mix. Yeah, <clears throat> everything I did as a kid in and around with my my parents was always around other people. We were always, I was hanging out with a bunch of friends. We were going to movies and making spectacles of ourselves at the movie theater. When we were at the movies or at a restaurant, everybody knew we were there. Everybody knew we were there. That's not a shock, Rick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, I, uh, it most, it's probably mostly because I just hate people. <laughs> <laughs> right? Most of the time, if you see me with my wife and we're walking past somebody, I'm like... That guy's a fucking idiot. <laughs> Here's something that's absolutely true. Corbin will break the pace of his walk and get really irritated oh. if he feels somebody's walking behind him too close. Yeah, that's probably one of my biggest pet peeves. It, is... you could, you'll be walking, we'll finish a movie, we come out, and if you watch Corbin break his walking pace, speed up, turn around, and watch his face, you know someone was walking too I close. I don't get anxious a lot. No, you get like, pissed. Like, my wife gets anxious about almost everything. She's, she's a very anxious person she has anxiety about a lot of things but the thing i get anxious about and i always have ever since i was a kid is i'm walking and it's not like a crowd crowd of people oh, it does, yeah exactly even though that that does bother me it's like if we're walking down the street and somebody is about two feet behind me and they're just just walking behind me i can't stand and maintaining it. your pace i can't stand it yeah i can't stand it i will and my wife tells me she's like, I, if I'm holding her hand, I will like squeeze her hand because I, I, I always know if somebody's around me, I'm that conscious of my personal bubble. And so I will literally just stand off to the side and just let everyone pass. It's I true. I've seen it. Don't care. It's true. I hate it so much. Do you remember when we went to see a film with, was it you and I, I thought it was, cause obviously it was on Moonlight by ourselves. Yeah, we did. But where somebody came and sat, it was only us, and somebody came and sat like two seats over from us in the theater. God. It's like, that bothers me. That's like, are you just kidding me? You have the entire theater. You have the whole theater, at least give a couple of seats. Yeah. Why are you gonna sit so close? Like, I, uh, people are too comfortable with other people. We need another plague. Oh wait. No! <laughs> no! Don't <laughs> <laughs>